Cameron's not here to join me for the intro because I'm filming this video again and he went into his little house and I don't want to disturb him but he'll definitely be at the end of the video you'll have a montage with a bunch of adorable Samster pictures because come on it's Samster how wouldn't we engage in Samster adorableness I mean come on what the hell <laughs> but hey guys I'm having actually a crappy day and I will definitely need some wholesome hamster. You didn't see nothing. <laughs> I will definitely want some wholesome hamster content to film right now. And I probably think that you're having a little bit of a bad day. So you're researching hamsters. And don't blame me for that. Hamsters are cute. But we're giving you 10 reasons why you should get a hamster. Maybe a little less because I couldn't think of 10 reasons. But they're adorable so you should get one. <laughs> yeah. We're thinking of 10 reasons why you should get a hamster. Reason number one. They're adorable. They're so cute. They're so fluffy. They're absolutely the most adorable pet you can have. I don't care what you think about hamsters. They're absolutely amazing. They're absolutely adorable. And if you're considering getting one, I think that's on your main list. Like the first thing you think about is, oh my God, I'm going to have this adorable tiny little baby creature in my house. I love it so much. So that is definitely reason number one, you should get a hamster. Reason number two. Well, although it is very easy to have one, you don't really realize how easy it is for the fact that they don't make any noise. They don't speak. They don't do anything they might hiss at you if you're in their personal space and you haven't tamed them but other than that your hamster is the chillest animal you have on this planet they don't make noise again ever which is very helpful if you are working and especially during the night like it is very helpful for you to have a quiet pet i cannot imagine what will be living with a dog that's constantly barking when you're trying to do work you have a hamster it doesn't make noise it's wonderful Another reason, num reason number three, is they're inexpensive. Hamsters are inexpensive. Whatever anybody tells you, hamsters can be had for very cheap. My thing, ten dollars. Ten dollars. You can get them off secondhand stores. You can probably get them for even cheaper than I did, but maybe around that price for somebody to, you know, get it. They need a pretty big cage. So getting it off like a secondhand side would definitely be your better call. I have a, a video all about like basic hamster care, so I'm gonna link it down below. It's not the best video, but you, it gives you some facts real quick. So they're inexpensive. Maybe the only expensive thing about them will be the fact that they need a big wheel. And if they get a big wheel, that's all good. We're doing all good, baby. And by the way, I made a couple of Samster renovations, so I might show you next time I'm cleaning his cage up. So, the next thing, they don't smell. They don't smell at all. Number four, they don't smell. Maybe your hamster, when you hold them and they haven't groomed themselves or something, they might smell a tiny itsy little bit, but it's nothing like a cat's litter box would smell. Their cage doesn't smell at all. And that is amazing. If you have allergies, your hamster's allergic to dust, so, you know, deal with that. But it is very fucking easy to have a hamster. They don't smell, they don't make noise. It's absolutely amazing. It is wonderful. They're very easy to tame, and they do take easy to hold, carry, and stuff like this. They're very friendly animals. They are scared of you, definitely. You're, I mean, bajillion times bigger than I am. Imagine a huge creature comes and wants to get you out of your sleep. Of course, you will be scared and run away. But they're very easy to tame. I think it takes about two to three weeks if you do it correctly. I'm gonna link a video down below on how to tame your hamster if you're a new hamster owner and you want to learn how to tame your hamster the correct way because I definitely did it incorrectly when I got my hamster because I didn't research correctly. I'm gonna make a whole video if you want on how to tame your hamster the correct way and what I did wrong and what you definitely shouldn't do. But they're very easy. If you do it the correct way, it will take you two to three weeks, max a month. But that's all. Like, very easy. Very chill. Chill is the common point. They don't need to go to the vet ever. 
I mean, that is a very self-explanatory thing, but they don't need to go to the vet, which means that they are even cheaper compared to cats and dogs. If they get an illness, yes, yeah, sure. But because not a lot of vets take care of hamsters, your hamster probably will end up dying of that illness. I'm very sorry. But if you take proper care of them, they will not get sick. Therefore, they will not need to go to the vet, which saves you money. And it's definitely something very different from a cat or a dog. My hamster hasn't gotten sick. Knock on wood, he would never. But, you know, I know hamsters get wet tail, get tumors and whatnot. But they're easy to cure if you catch it immediately and you go to the vet with that complaint. To a vet that will, of course, take your hamster. And you can take care of that, again, for inexpensive because it's such a tiny animal. Being so tiny, they're a little easy to lose that death. But they're nocturnal. So that means during the day, your ass is at work or at school or doing important shit. They're sleeping through it. And at night, when you're doing your night activities, they'll just wake up. You have a little bit of playtime. You feed them, and that's it. You know, you don't... I know when you want a pet, you want a lot of interaction with them immediately. That is not gonna happen with a hamster that easily. They don't really respond that much to interaction. You can pet them, they'll run around, you can have fun with them. You can think of a lot of fun things to do with your hamster, but it's definitely not a dog, it's not a cat, it's not a bunny, it's a hamster. Don't have your expectations very high. They're adorable. They'll run around your hand. Maybe they'll run around your body if you let them. I personally lay down. He runs around all of me. Then I catch him. I put him back into his cage. We have a fun time like that. He bites my feet. I don't know why he insists on doing that, but he likes it. You're having fun time with him. You're having amazing. And it's cool. It's cool cheap. You know? They don't need that much attention. You know? They don't... This is my eighth point. They don't need that much attention. As I said, they're nocturnal, which means they'll be awake during the night. You don't have to worry about them during the day. It's very easy to spend little time with them. They're not that engaging of a pet in and of itself. So, of course, that's easy. That can suck if you want that interaction, but it's definitely easy pet to have. It doesn't need too much of you. It doesn't want to be taken out on walks or have its litter box changed. You know? You don't need to clean often for them, by the way. That's number nine. Nine. That's number nine. You don't need to clean their cage very often. Hamsters actually don't really like their cage being torn apart because they have a nest. They nest. And that's their safe space, that's their home. Imagine somebody destroying your entire house and you have to build it all over again. And they do that every single month. It sucks and you don't have to clean if you just put enough bedding. The smelly parts, if they're smelly parts or you notice that your hamster goes to pee or poop in one area, you can just take that area out, fill it up a little bit with the bedding you took out, like the same amount just fresh bedding it's pretty much that it doesn't need like a whole ass clean every single time i put way too little bedding in and i understand that but if you don't put as little as i do you can definitely get away with not cleaning it for like two or three months for sure for sure even more and the last reason why you should get a hamster is because they're adorable and they'll probably get fed to some random snakes so why not Get a hamster yourself. Think about all of the benefits I just listed. They're such an easy pet. You will love having a hamster. You have two years of amazing joy. And I don't know. I don't understand why you wouldn't want one. So in the comments down below, tell me if you like this video. I hope I made your day because this definitely made me feel a lot better. And I need a fucking tow glass of water after narrating all of this because I never do scripted videos, but this one is. So amen to that. But if you like this and you like my content, there's a link in the description down below that says more of my hamster videos and definitely more from me. 
like subscribe and comment and let's get into the samson montage because he's fucking adorable and you waited 10 minutes to see my hamster so here you go happy people bye from me for now and we'll see you next monday bye